Hey guys, Sai is here back with another interesting and most important video. Today I came with two best methods to pass strong integrity. As we know, presently uh, Google banned our previous valid key box. So presently we don't have any valid key box. Okay, because the key box which we are using recently that key box is revoked, right? So when you're going on KSU web application and when you're going to set valid key box, it says no valid key box, right? But some glitches is there, some loop holes is there. So that's why presently in most of the cases, strong integrity going to pass as in my case, as we can see, I passed my strong integrity, device integrity, and of course, basic integrity. So you are also able to pass this integrity, but, but you know to need some important points. What that points, I will tell you. Okay, so talking about first important point, flash latest security patch custom ROMs. Okay, second important point, try my different module methods. So let's start with first method. So here it is. I'm going to show you first method. So here it is the required modules. Download these all modules, install KSU web application. Okay, uh, check description. I will provide all uh, modules on Telegram. So simply join our Telegram channel where you will get this all modules. So flash module sequence wise, first module you need to flash Zygisk next. Okay, flash Zygisk next device. Uh, okay, after that reboot your device. Then next module which you need to flash Let's talk about that module. Okay, as we can see next module, which we need to flash that is plain integrity fix inject flash this module. This is a second module. Okay, go with sequence wise. Next talking about third module flash tricky store. Okay, flash this then go back next module tricky store add on. Okay, then last and final module, which we need to flash that is integrity box version eight. Okay. Flash this all modules, reboot your device once. Okay. Next we need to do some important things. Please don't skip any part. Okay. It will, it will take a little bit of seconds. Okay, simply reboot your device once. Okay, after complete reboot, as we can see, all the modules are for flash successful. Now search KSU and give the root permission to KSU web application. Now open KSU web application. Now click on tricky store, then click on three lines on top of right, then select all, then deselect unnecessary, then sit. Uh, select on valid key box. It says no valid key box. Ignore it. Then click on security patch setup like previously I told in my first method video. So watch that video. If you don't watch that video, okay, try that first method after that the second method. Now go back and click on play integrity fix inject. Okay, then enable this spoof provider toggle then click on fetch pf dot json. That's it. Now go back now open API checker play integrity as we can see passed. Okay. Now talking about third method. Okay. So as we can see here, it is the third method. Second method we perform successful now talking about third method. So as we can see my all integrities, I mean all checks are wrong. Now talking about required modules as we can see here, it is the required modules for required modules, play integrity, fixed tricky store, Euro key and Zygisk next. So now flash sequence wise, first we need to flash Zygisk next module. Okay. After flashing once reboot your device, it is better. Okay. After that, go back install second module, which is play integrity fix. Okay. You can use play integrity fix fork also if you want. Okay. Then next module tricky store. Okay, flash it after flashing tricky store, go back and last module, which we need to flash that is your key. Okay, flash this last module, reboot your device. After that, go on module section as we can see all modules successfully flashed. Now click on this your key key box manager and it will load some files. Click on action button and wait some time.
Okay, when it is done successful, now click on play integrity fix inject, act, uh, click on open, then click on advanced, then click on spoof provider, enable this, then click on fetch pif.json. Okay, that's it. After complete this, go on API checker application and check your strong integrity, basic integrity, device integrity going to pass. If strong integrity not going to pass, device integrity is pass, it is okay, don't worry. You can use a lot of application on device integrity passing. Device integrity passing means your device gonna certified and most of the application check device is certified or not, okay? Talking about strong integrity, some apps check strong integrity also, but most of the application presently uh, working fine if your device is certified. That means if your device uh, integrity is pass, then it is fine. Okay, see you in the next video. Love you guys. Goodbye. Take care. If any new PIF valid keybox file is came, then I will definitely make video on it. Okay, so presently if in your case this method is going to work, then good. If this method is not going to work, so try my uh, tips. Okay, I said you uh, flash any latest version, I mean latest build custom ROM, latest security custom ROM, okay. So on that custom ROM, uh, this module is going to work and you can pass your strong integrity also, okay. But if you don't have any latest build custom ROM available for your device, then you need to wait for valid unbanned key box file, okay. So this is the video. Let's see you in the next video. Love you guys. Goodbye. Take care.